Christ, let us prepare ourselves to go in heart and mind to Bethlehem and to see the child lying in a manger. Let us read and mark the story of God's loving purposes and of the glorious redemption brought us by this holy child. And let us make this chapel dedicated to his pure and lowly mother, glad with our songs of praise. But first, let us pray for peace and goodwill over all the earth for unity and brotherhood at home and in Her Majesty's dominions. And because this would rejoice His heart of love, let us remember before God the cold, the hungry, and the oppressed, the sick and those that mourn, the lonely and the unloved, the aged and the little children, all those who know not the Lord Jesus or who love him not, and those who rejoice with us but upon another shore and in a greater light. The Almighty God bless us with his grace. Christ give us the joys of everlasting life. And unto the fellowship of the citizens above, may the King of Angels Bring us all. Amen. St. John unfoldeth the great mystery of the Incarnation. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. The same was in the beginning with God, all things were made by him, and without him was not anything made that was made. In him was life, and the life was the light of men. And the light shineth in darkness, and the darkness comprehended it not. He was that true light which lighteth every man that cometh into the world. And the Word was made flesh and dwelt among us, and we beheld his glory, the glory as of the only begotten of the Father, full of grace and truth. Thanks be to God. 